<clears throat> Hello, welcome to Slim Tech and Gaming, where I give y'all the latest IPTV service, uh, latest uh, gadgets, and um, gaming. You know what I'm saying? Whoever popping out in the street, I got my nose into the game. You know what I'm saying? Ten toes down. So anyway, you know what I'm saying? I did make a video talking about um, TV streams. And like I said, just like uh, just like set TV, it works every every way. This it works the same way. They use the same servers, got the same interface. It is branded uh, different. You know what I'm saying? Um, I don't know if they were using set TV servers or set TV using their servers, but they are using the same same servers. You know, set TV got shut down last week. So they out of business, you know what I'm saying, and um, and they if they might pop up at a different entity. It be probably late on this year, maybe next year. Who knows? You know what I'm saying. I know uh, whoever the owners of that company, man, they knee deep. <laughs> they they gonna be knee deep in debt. You know what I'm saying. But we got some alternative. Uh, I did make a video about. Stream TV, I'm gonna show you how to set it up. It's the same way. You need a browser. So if you have like uh, a Fire Stick, I uh, suggest you go to the store, get the download, um, download it. It has the browser on there. And um, you have the, um, for like the Android TV, you have a, a, a choice between getting the ES File Explorer or download. I like the ES File Explorer. I think you better get on the Fire Stick too. But um, say like if you have um, a NVIDIA Shield or even like your TV have an Android interface like this, you can do the voice command and say downloader and you got the apps for the, oh uh, wait, that's not the apps, that, oh shit, oh man, my bad. Downloader app. All right, so you go to download the app and then you go to ES file. Uh, ES files for file manager. I love this; it's real good. You can also get the download the app. You know what I'm saying? Like you might, I like, I think like on like Nvidia Shield. You know the one with the Google got the full Google interface. You might get APK, but I say get this right here and you click on there and you can install it. Or I got mine installed, so I just hit open. And it'll come up like this. Now on here, I have a Yahoo, uh, uh, Yahoo search engine. So you click on there, um, blow the screen up. And oh yeah, and also nice to have like a keyboard. You know what I'm saying? Um, I got me like a Logi Logitech keyboard. It's pretty cool. You know what I'm saying? Wireless. I got the dongle, I just plug in the back of my Nvidia shield and you know so I can just type, you know what I'm saying? It's real easy. It only cost like like 25 bucks, man. It only cost that much, you know what I'm saying? Got that best buy. I think like Walmart have an old version for like 20 bucks. And I believe um Target got one for like 20 bucks too. But you know, I, I fully support Best Buy. I gotta get my points up and stuff. But anyway, um you're gonna type in TV streams now. So we're gonna search for it. So you gotta look for the official site, TV streams now. Click on that. And it's gonna take you straight to the page. You know, got a 20, uh, $25 a month. And it includes three devices per household. Now, let me say this. If you have a mobile device, whether it be a phone or a tablet, you can take that anywhere. You know what I'm saying? As long as you have internet service, you better watch TV streams for any, anywhere. But like you have like a Fire Stick or Android TV box or just a, you know, Android box period. You know what I'm saying? It's going to be stuck into your IP address. So you can't even use a VPN because VPN change your IP address. So you can't use VPN on this service. Um, so if you if you end up trying to take like your 
fire stick or hand of the box to a friend's house to watch pay per view event. What they're going to do, it might come in clear for about five, ten minutes, but they're going to block it, you know what I'm saying? And, you know, keep on doing it. They're going to lock your, they're going to lock your account down and then you got to call them and get it cut back on, you know what I'm saying? So, to avoid all that hassle, what I tell people to do, I like, use your phone, get like a um, USB to HDMI cord, and you can plug it from your phone straight to the TV. Bam. Got it. I always loophole through all that. But I'm gonna make a video about um, about how to do that later on this month, maybe next month, you know what I'm saying? But anywho, um, they got like, I think like three different plans, I believe. So um, let me click on here. Go to the the pricing and twenty five dollars for one month, and then they have the let's keep it kind of fast. They have the three month plan, and you saving just five dollars for like three months, and then you have a um, six months plan. You have a twelve month plan. Wait, no, yeah, six months plan for one forty. And then you got two of my plan for 260. I tell people like this. I said do the one month, one month, and three month plan. Because um you go in higher than that, you don't know how these IP services are gonna be doing because like you know TV stream might be on the next shopping block. We don't know. They be on the radar, you know what I'm saying? But you don't want to take no risk because if you put you invest a lot of money into this service. You know what I'm saying? It's not, I mean, it's the streaming, watching movies, because you ain't downloading nothing. Um, it's le it's legit. You know what I'm saying? It's a gray area, but still, it's not illegal. You can't go to jail. It's not illegal. Um, oh, yeah, for the United States. I know for the UK, that's a whole different ball game. You know what I'm saying? You can't download and you can't watch. You know what I'm saying? So they probably throw people in jail in the UK. But I know in the United States, as long as we ain't downloading nothing, we good. You know what I'm saying? Only thing that can um like I said, like if you were if you were uh have your own IPTV service and like you know what I'm saying, you was streaming, delivering the streams and all that, you rebroadcasting, you know what I'm saying, yeah, you're gonna get you gonna get tapped, you know what I'm saying? Just like set TV. But uh, I tell people just get like the do the one month and do the three months to play safe, you know what I'm saying? Um, I'm just testing this service out. I'm using Intern TV. Excellent service, you know what I'm saying? I'll do a review on that, you know what I'm saying, for a later time. But uh, to get started, um, we click on here. They give you a, a so-called free three-day trial, but it's not free because you still got to put $25 down. Still got to pay $25, you know what I'm saying? So, uh, this I already got one in the um okay so all right this pop up right here so they got a three day trial and everything and then um go ahead check out so you have to put in your first last name email cell phone you gotta create your password put in your address city postcode you know what I'm saying? Country, state, etc. Now, I know what y'all saying. I know a lot of people feel kind of fishy about it. I wouldn't worry about it. Um, you can put in, you can make them a name. Uh, email address got to be legit because that's how they're going to send you the APK. You know what I'm saying? And send you your, um, your username and password. You know what I'm saying? You can give them a dummy cell phone. Create your password. I think you do have to put. I think I don't know. You can try, but you know you can put a dummy address, city postcode. I don't know. I just might put the legit address and city. You know what I'm saying? Postcode state. I think I'll do legit on that. You know what I'm saying? But I say you definitely don't have to put your first and last name on there. You can make up a first and last name. You can put. Jim Kelly, you know what I'm saying? And, you know, it, it, it's straight, you know what I'm saying? So, 
Once you put that information down, because you have to put the information down to be able to move forward. So once you get that put down, your um, paper method, going to be your debit card or credit card. Um, I, I would recommend people to get like a green dot or get one of those um, Walmart debit cards from the, you know, from a store or whatnot. You know what I'm saying? Don't use your bank card. Don't use your own credit card. If for safety reasons, you know what I'm saying? Because they, they might get hacked. It's best to be safe than sorry. So when you click next, you got to put in your payment information. And once you do that, you know what I'm saying? They're going to take $25, you know what I'm saying? Off the rip. And they're going to send you a code. They're going to send you an email address and you'll be good to go. So I already, I already got the, um, I already got the app and stuff. So it's gonna basically when you download the app, like I say it's gonna look like this. TV streams gonna come up like this, and like I said, um, it's a real cut the volume down because it's probably really loud. It's real, um, it's real simple. You know, it got a, it got a EPG. Got to catch up, you know what I'm saying? Only thing about that, you got to um, you got to chat with them to get it activated, you know what I'm saying? Um, then you got the EPG, and then it shows what the what what's popping, what's popular right now, you know what I'm saying? They they whole they whole guide is kind of it's a hit and miss, as you can see it. You got on like loading and when it do load you got some says no tv programming but it probably is when i click on there see it pop up you know what i'm saying so i can't i'm showing that just the tv guy itself i don't want to show all the channels still because you know i don't want to get hit with it hit by um youtube you know what i'm saying but um basically it 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 shows some of the shows and stuff yeah, you got Monk, you know what I'm saying, but, you know, the God is not accurate, you know what I'm saying, because, like, it's not even playing Monk, or well, it might show me some mercy, oh, I got Team Mom, too, you know what I'm saying, that's accurate, and, it's, and, it, and, it, and the, um, the service, like, it's straight HD, it, it might have a few stations that, is, um, that be a, a little bit cloudy, a tad bit, but most of them is like pure HD and stuff. You know? Cereal. Also try these other great post cereals. But uh, it, it works, man. As soon as you turn station, just like that, instant, man. You know, I I've been through I've been to a lot of IPT uh, IPTV services. This is by far like the fastest that I ever used. Like it just like set TV. You know what I'm saying? It's fast. Once you click on it. It's like you having regular cable, you know what I'm saying? Only thing about it, you know what I'm saying? It might be missing some channels. It might be down one day, then be back up the next day. You know what I'm saying? Just like Set TV, it's hit and miss. And like they God is not 100%. It's more like 50%. With, it, with the TV streams, 50%. Set TV is like 80%, you know what I'm saying? You know, I don't even say what's playing, you know what I'm saying? It worked. It just say no TV program, but it's working. But this junk is like smooth, buttery smooth. You know what I'm saying? I guess this one's not. Okay, it's showing. See, this one I ain't got no voice behind it. Oh, yeah, I do. So it is, um, it, it works pretty smooth. You know what I'm saying? Then, like I say, you got the the movie section. You go to new releases. How's the dog blockers? Blockers this is an alright movie. You know what I'm saying? Uh, Yellow Bird, Duff Superman, pretty good. Ready Player One. They might have a hard copy of that right now. Rampage. It was alright. A little bit corny. We got a bunch of movies that's 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 out in the theater that you can watch now. Escape Plan Two. You know, long list, man. Acrimony, which is that was a real good movie, man. Crazy. But it got a long list of movies, man. And also it also does T V shows. It just like set T V, you know what I'm saying? 
Oh, he has the TV shows. Uh, one thing I do need to double check. I really need to check and see if they have. Um, crap. I'm back out of there. I got to see if they have the pay per view. Uh, I think this one might not have pay per view on here. And I only had to serve for about a week. Shoot. One second. Hmm. One second. Crap. You gotta excuse me. I'm just winging it right now. You know what I'm saying? I ain't worried about doing editing, man. This is raw and uncut. See how beautiful that channel was, man. That thing was sharp. Hmm. Let's see. Maybe leaves action being found. Let's see. Huh. They might not have it. They might not have it. I got to do some more searching. But you see that. You see it's real clear. I only had it for about about a week or so. But I got I got I got to check thorough and see if I'll be able to see if they have like a um, pay-per-view. They might not have it on here, you know. But uh, I'm sure going to check. But I said it's $25 a month. You're getting full HD on like 95% of the channels. The, the, um, the guy, like I said, it's like, it's like 50, 50, you know what I'm saying? So I wouldn't even worry about the guy, you know what I'm saying? Shoot, man, if you just some watch this, watch some, but if you need a reliable guy, this won't be the IP. This won't be the IPTV service for you because that guy is not, it's not accurate, man. It's like 50% if that accurate. But it, it showed real good and stuff. But um, like I said, um, I have, I would have a link in the description. You know what I'm saying? I do have a link in the description on my first video. This one too, I'll put the link in the description so you go straight to it. And be able to go to the site and set everything up. You know what I'm saying? I will be doing a, um, a review on external TV. It is a great app. Um, but they only they only do uh, a few subscribers like every other month. You know what I'm saying? Because they're trying to keep it low. So the basically, so they have great customer service. Because only like a few of them. Probably like three of them that work in, work in that service. You know what I'm saying? So they can try and manage it. But um, they do have, it is a, like a third party called Cody Solutions, and they use the uh, Turn TV platform, you know what I'm saying? They just rebranded, it and it's, and it's worked the same. Like I paid $8 a month for the, uh, for the Turn TV um, Cody Solutions, um, it about the same thing, $8 a month, you get like three connections. And like I said, you can go um, anywhere, you're not locked down your IP address. You can take your device to somebody else's house and whatever, you know what I'm saying? But I will do a review on, on external TV and um, on Cody Solutions, you know what I'm saying? They're both the same, but I'll go ahead and do it anyway. But um, hey, this is TV streams, and you know, you want something close to set TV, this is it. So I'll catch y'all later.